Tom in Appleton, Wisconsin, but there's lots of good apples there. <laughs> he says, hey Paul, I was taught that an inverter changes the polarity of DC voltage from positive to negative or vice versa. That makes sense. It's inverting from positive to negative. It's not correct, but it makes sense. <laughs> um, and that a converter changes DC to AC and that a rectifier changes AC to DC. I, I hear the terms inverter and converter intermixed so often as if one is the same as the other. Which is, which is it used in a car stereo amplifier's PWM switch mode power supply to convert the nominal 12 volt DC from the car's battery to 60 volts DC or something similar? Am I thinking uh, correctly that it's a converter? All right. So, Let's see if I can, help. by the way, before we get started, I just, you know, I stand by all these cool things. Check this out, isn't this nice? That's the new baffle from the FR10. Oh, that's the, the speakers there, that's so cool. Some beautiful little six and a halfs. The FR10 is going to be one of the next speakers after, well, we already launched the FR20 Aspen speakers and that's the baffle from the FR10, which, you know, stands about that high, people are gonna love this sucker. Oh my God, it's heavy. Okay, inverters, converters, and all of that. So, officially, an inverter is used to convert DC voltage to AC voltage. So we use an inverter to take, say, the output of your solar panels at home they produce DC voltage. And what we want out of the wall to run our computers and all of that is AC voltage, right? So we use an inverter. And maybe that's not the best term, but that's what it is. So we can convert in the car, you asked about that, your switch mode power supply. That's an inverter as well. That power supply takes DC, 12 volts, and ups it to something else. Now, it can also up it to DC. There are DC to DC inverters, but generally DC to AC. A converter is used to convert one thing to another, and that's confusing because obviously an inverter is also doing that. <laughs> but if we want to convert one AC voltage to another AC voltage, that very typically happens. So in a power supply, we have, let's say 120 volts coming in, and we want out of that power supply, oh, say 20 volts DC. We use a converter if it's a switch mode power supply. Otherwise, we just use a transformer, which we've talked about before. But we use a switch mode power supply where it takes it and chops that AC up and runs it through a little transformer. Somehow we're gonna use that transformer to convert the voltage from this high to this low, and then we, we can keep it as AC if we want, or we can run it through a diode bridge, a rectifier bridge, and convert it to DC, and out it comes. So bottom line, inverters are typically used to convert DC like that from a solar panel or a battery into AC voltage, and everything else is a converter. <laughs> How's that? <laughs> All right. Thanks for the question. I'll talk to you later. <laughs> Bye.